Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel Grow with Mamta. I myself is Mamta. So guys, in today's video we are going to talk about misconceptions of English language. There are so many misconceptions out there about English language. And because of that, there are so many English learners that they just give up learning English language because of these misconceptions. And I'm going to clear your mind that these are only misconceptions or nothing else okay without any further ado let's get started this video first misconception that we are going to talk about okay which is which is that if i know more english vocabularies then i can speak in english it is a big misconception because guys in order to speak in english initially in the beginning you just need to know some basic vocabs you just need to know some basic words vocabularies and daily uses vocabularies and daily uses vocabularies are not more you can learn them so in the beginning you just need to learn basic vocabularies okay so it don't think about when i learned so advanced words and so uh, complicated and complex words then only i can speak in english no no, it's not like that. You can speak by using some little set of words in English. Okay, so let's talk about the next. Next is grammar. We talk, if we talk about grammar, everyone, you know, some of the people that just say, uh, if I learn grammar, then I can be... I can be fluent in English if I know very well grammar. So it's not like that. There are so many people that they have never learned grammar, but they are so fluent in English. Because guys, uh, grammar is something that you learn uh, study wise. I mean, when you are studying the language, when you are preparing for an examination. So in order to crack that examination, that so that you need to learn grammar deeply. But for speaking, in order to speak in English language, you just need to speak the language. Means a okay, if you are so obsessed about learning grammar, so you can learn that. But at an initial level, you don't need to learn more grammar because grammar is something very vast, vast topic in which you would be entangled. You will feel stuck and you are going to kill your interest about English language because grammar is also always boring thing. So um, make sure in the beginning, you don't need to more focus on grammar more, more, more. You, you just need to focus on speaking. Okay. So um, let's talk about the next thing. Next thing is, I am from Hindi medium. Can I speak in English? Definitely. Absolutely. You can speak in English. Of course, guys, you can speak in English. If you're not from Hindi, if you are not from English medium. Okay. I'm also from Hindi medium. Uh, I've completed my 10th. So from Hindi medium, I've completed my 12th from UP board. I mean, Hindi medium. Now I'm in my college. So everything in English, really. I'm I'm doing Bachelor of Science BSc right now. Okay, so uh, don't think about I'm from this medium that medium so I cannot speak in English. You can speak definitely. Think of you can do this. It's just a language. Your um, medium. If you talk about medium, that means that was study wise. You know. Hindi medium, English medium, you are studying, okay, to some extent, it is right, if uh, you are from English medium, that means you are writing in English, you are studying, you are listening English, so that is good thing, but uh, if you are saying, I am not, I'm, I'm not from English medium, that means I cannot speak in English, you can speak English, get out of from this wrong thinking, okay, so let's talk about the next thing, next thing is, if I join any course, until I join any course, until I join a course, I will not be able to speak in English. It is very wrong thinking because guys, without joining any course, you can speak in English. I haven't joined any course, even still today. At, okay, so you don't need a course to learn English language because there is YouTube, there is internet, there are so many things. Leverage it guys leverage it you have to grab the opportunity to learn english language by using internet and this is guys information <laughs> information is i think it's 
so we can do anything without joining any course maybe you want to learn anything there could be something or the other on youtube you can learn through that okay so english is something it's a language if you have money if you are so obsessed about joining courses so you can join that but if you do not have money so don't be don't try to stress out that i don't have this so i cannot do this what you have you try to use that you don't think of uh, this thing that i do not have that means i cannot do this think of what i have and i can use that thing to improve myself to learn something to grow okay guys try to think of what you have do not try to think of what i do not have okay for example i am living in a village i do not have much more privileges than a person who is living in a city but even still i think okay whatever i have i'm going to use that maybe god wants me to create my own legacy god wants me to change my own my my own trajectories okay so try to think positive only positive thinking it positive thinking it does not mean you will <laughs> you will not fa uh, face failure you will face failure positive thinking means you will face failure even then you are ready to go for the more even then you are ready to go ahead even then you are ready to put your efforts towards that okay this is the positive thinking you will fail you will get success <laughs> without failure where is success you cannot um, enjoy success without failure so you cannot enjoy speaking english without making mistakes because once you speak wrong english once you make lots of mistakes and next day you realize oh my god these all are mistakes so next day you're gonna rectify them okay so anyway where <laughs> Uh, what was the topic yeah courses so without joining any course you can learn english language by listening by speaking by practice and by observing people honestly observing is something that you can observe people how that they are speaking and how that they are pronouncing the words it is the best way to learn english language okay and uh, next that i'm going to talk about i am a villager i am from a village i am from very rural area i am from town how can i speak in english i do not i cannot speak in english because i'm from village and village people are like who don't even speak in english so it is not like that whether you're from city or whether you're from um, you know a village that doesn't matter all the matter is what you think in your head you think that i am villager so what i can speak i want to speak i can speak for example if i talk about myself i thought i need to speak when i knew the importance of english language then i thought oh my god it doesn't matter i'm i'm from village or city it does not matter for me <coughs> sorry all the matter is what i want to do what i want to become what i want to learn i am going to learn that no matter what so where you are from where is your residence um, where do you dwell up that doesn't matter all the matter is what you want to do okay in your head try to believe in yourself what you believe you are that okay so don't think about your residence okay next thing that i'm going to talk about and i think guys the the biggest problem is environment we do not have environment we do not have an environment to speak in english okay this is the biggest problem all are the like at a superficial level but the cause is the real the root cause is environment if you are in a english environment for example so we can speak english effortlessly we can learn english effortlessly as we are speaking our mother tongue effortlessly the same we can speak english effortlessly when we are in a environment in an environment of english language but we don't have we don't have a offline environment we have only online environment so you can create online environment you have youtube social media so many things so try to create online environment 
in your head you can create that only then you can speak this language first of all you have to immerse yourself into this language then only you can be friendly with this okay so don't think about that i do not have environment so that i cannot speak in english there are so many people out there that they are speaking in english effortlessly without any hesitation without fumbleness uh, even then they even they do not have any environment so they if they can do if those guys can do we can do as well guys come on <laughs> okay you know so it's all about today uh so guys one thing uh, i would like to tell you guys once we start speaking the language once we start speaking in the language things cop up guys things cop up mm, we come across w- with words and we come across words and uh, um i mean uh, phrasal verbs and grammar all rules and we come across while speaking in english There's only one way to learn the language speak the language speak the language come on guys don't think about the mistakes mistakes are the normal take it in a like something that you can that you are facing right now but it is helping you a lot it is looking bad for you it is looking like it's not good for me it is very very good for me extremely good for you guys don't think about that okay while speaking you lose your confidence this is the problem you know you you need to speak your broken whatever you, your level is that doesn't matter all the matter is you need to speak it you need to speak this language but you are overwhelming and you are thinking i cannot speak you have to think i can speak i can speak that's it you have to say this and you need to speak it and with confidence confidence in something that you need to build okay for example i'm saying ram is going ram is going okay it's right you say ram are going ram are going so it's something i'm speaking wrong i i know that ram are going but see the contrast you know i say ram is going it's looking maybe it would be wrong when i say ram are going it's looking wrong it is wrong but i'm speaking with confidence that is important confidence is important and speak your whatever you know you know speak the language only it can only help you to learn this language and things cop up along the way when you start learning this language really guys okay guys i hope this video would be a little bit helpful for you so please do not forget to like subscribe i'm looking forward to reading your comments and bye bye guys and take care and last thing please smile learn something with smile no matter what okay